So here I am, I'm on my wife's family farm here and uh, just looking at the Uxasu at the moment. It's coming along very nicely, not that I'd know. Uh, I can I even take off my sunglasses and it's a beautiful day but the sun has gone behind the clouds. So I'm just taking a walk around here, I'll give you guys a look. As you can see, plenty of potatoes. As an Irish person, I'm very pleased about this. Nice field of potatoes there. And uh, most of what these guys grow is, especially these days, is uh, oxisu, which is white corn, Korean corn, potatoes, and uh, this is namul, which uh, Koreans use a lot for Sam, what's called Sam, in other words, they wrap food in it and it's absolutely delicious. It's a great way and a healthy way to eat. Some of the farms out here are quite close to each other, so you might see some people pop up and down. I'll have to put on my mask if that happens. These are really important in Korea because people will uh, dry them out when they've grown the peppers and then they grind it down either into a powder or make a paste, which is very important for helping to make a lot of different food and preserving the food. And I'm going to turn around and show you a beautiful sky. Look at this. Look at that sky. What a day, amazing. So you can see my friend, the scarecrow down there, he's got the best job in town and he hasn't been too busy today, it looks like. Um, but that just gives you a little view across and it's a kind of community here. Farms are much smaller than in Ireland where we have a lot of animals, livestock, cows and pigs and and sheep and so on. In Korea there's a lot of arable farming and people are small stakeholders or smaller ones and so they tend to farm together, help each other out. It's really cool. So now I'm, I'm walking around by my wife's old primary school, as we'd say in Ireland, Chodan Hakyo, they say here in Korea. And it's right beside where she used to live. So it's really cute, but it's kind of quiet and solemn. And as you can see, it's in an awesome place, really in the countryside. And uh, it's very cute. All the statues are quite old. I don't know when the school was built, but uh, everything here feels a little older, you know? So. Let's check it out. Here we are on the bridge. Yeah, there's a little river, a little stream beside the school. But check this out. Can you imagine if you're a little kid, how much fun you'd have in there? And this is where the fermenting bean paste is kept. Uh, Dwenjan, this is used to make soup, all kinds of stuff. Really amazing. Keeps it in these pots, it ferments over time. You can see that inside.